welcome back to the channel and today we're going for a full English breakfast in M&S. See how much it is and uh, see if it's worth it and I will see you in there. See you in a minute. Welcome back. Well, we're in M&S now in Gemini. Nice big place this. I think it's one of the biggest uh, around. This is in Wellington. And I've just ordered the um, big traditional breakfast. It was 8 95 right? Going up a bit here. And a coffee. The old lot came to £12 something. I'll get the right amount after. Um, but um, I'll just show you what we've got. Just show you what we've got. Then what do we get for £8.95? We get two ash browns, we get two poached eggs, we get a real big mushroom, we get two three bits of bacon, we have two sausages, and it's a slice of toast really. We cut it in two. And beans. So that's what we've got. So let's tuck in and see what it's like. Right, let's get into this breakfast. Um, bit of salt. Just a little bit of salt, especially for the eggs. Now these are poached eggs, right? Um, I love poached eggs, uh, but when the lady came, these poached eggs, they're half done when they come in, into my Manessa told me. So they don't do, there's a machine, and these do, do them in the machine, and it's all, um, they're half done, but it has to make them old soft inside and shall we show you now we're going to see what these poached eggs are like should be all soft in the middle oh yeah let's have a look at the other one. Oh yeah perfectly done but as i say they come in half done into m&s because this breakfast it was so quick it was uh, i sat down and it was there. Try this breakfast now. Here we go. Now we're going in for the ash browns. See the ash browns? Going in for these. Yeah, they've got like um They're not they're very soft in the inside, they're not crispy on the outside. Um, but they're very um, a bit herby. What it tastes like. Now the beans are in one of these posh uh, dishes again, like you got in Morrison's. But I don't think there's as many beans. Let's have a look. I'm gonna pour it out now. No, not as many beans as Morrison's, but let's go for the taste. No sauce on these, by the way. I'm doing it with no sauce. They're all right. They're okay. Uh, going in for the big mushroom. Now, I love mushrooms, and these are the... Uh, mozzarella mushrooms. Okay. Yeah, it's mushrooms are mushrooms, aren't they? Mm. All right. Now the butter is M&S butter. M&S butter. I'm going to butter the toast and um, for eight ninety five. I would have thought you would have got a bit more toast. I do. 95. Right, we're going in for the toast here with the butter, M and S butter. Mm. 
Let's show Kai. So Kai. Let's go in for this sausage. m and sausage. Oh, they're tasty. They're not very big. I mean, that's just, I've just cut half of that off. Not a very big sausage. But they're tasty. They're tasty. Um, let's go in for this bacon. Better bacon. It's streaky bacon. It's not bad. It's all right. Now let's go in for the um, making the butter. I'm gonna get the um, the butter again. I just wish they would have put another piece of toast on. You know, it's only one piece of toast it's cut in two. Um, just wish they could have done that really for the price. You know. Um, Right then, we're going to go in for the butty. Right then. Let's see what we can do now. You know I like dippy eggs. This is a dippy egg with on poached egg. This is a nice poached egg, by the way. Bit of beans. I don't need a lot of beans, as you know. Um, a bit of sausage. You see that? Let's go in for this. An M&S butty. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Is it as good as Morrison's? I don't know. But it's nice. The sausages are nice. This is supposed to be a big breakfast. This. Now people are saying, on a traditional breakfast, you shouldn't get ash browns, but everywhere you go these days, there's ash browns, isn't there? Every, you'd say they come from, it comes from America. Um, but everywhere you go now, hotels that you go to, it's Ash Browns, isn't it? Um, but I never got them in um, in Morrison's. I, I like the um, the old fresh tomato and all that, which is not here. It's the mushroom. I think it's the best part. The eggs and the uh, the sausages are the best part of the breakfast. Other than that, I'm leaving most of it, so um, I'll show you. Bye bye. All right, let's get down to business about this um, full English breakfast in M&S. Well, the poached eggs were, were good, really good. I like them poached eggs. Two sausages were good, a bit small. Um, pieces of toast were all right. Only one piece of toast, and you cut it in half. I expected two <coughs> pieces of toast, really, for a big breakfast. The portobello um, mushroom, a bit soggy, but they are soggy sometimes, but it was all right. I left half of that. Um, the ash browns, I left half of one. You've seen it on the plate. I didn't eat it all. Um, it wasn't crispy on the outside. I liked them. And uh, very soft on the inside. A bit herby. I don't, I don't mind the, the taste, but it was all right. Um, the bacon, I think it was smoky bacon, and it was um, streaky. That's what it tastes like to me. The beans were just beans. Uh, I don't know if the Heinz or what are their own, but it was, they were just beans. There was no really taste to the beans. But the whole breakfast, um, what would I give it? But the, for the whole breakfast, I would give this a 
a six and a half out of ten. That's what I'd give it, six and a half out of ten. Um, is it worth eight ninety five? No. It's not worth eight ninety five at all. I think what you're paying for is the name and where you are. I mean, it's now half past ten and believe it or not, the cafe is nearly full. So there's a lot of MS fans in the country and um, they're willing to pay for it which is up to them isn't it you know i'm just giving my honest opinion of what i think about the the big breakfast in mns and would i come again i'd just come for a coffee uh, hope you like the video and uh, we'll see you very very soon bye bye